they come in matching J's. I'm like, damn, it's over for me. <laughs> and I just cut off after that. Where he at now, though? Shit. I think I seen him at McDonald's somewhere. There you go. Well, Working hey. at that motherfucker. Hey. Morning, everybody. It's DJ NV Angela Yee, Charlemagne the God. We are The Breakfast Club. We got a special guest with us this morning. What it do? From Detroit. What up, doe? T Grizzly. What's going on? What's, What's up? up, sir? What's the deal, man? It's T Grizzly. You know I'm from the D. And we love kicking it with our people. We love good food. We love bad bitches. So right now, you watching dinner with Grizzly. Let's eat. Ah. Hey, the safe out of space. Like the roof of the wraith. Yeah. House got a view of the lake. Might go canoeing today. Yeah. What's up, though? This is T Grizzly. You having dinner with Grizzly. Here with my guest, the legend, the GOAT, DJ Envy. What's up, though? What's up, bro? Cool. So the topic of today's show is what is a cutoff game? When do you got to pull that out? I got a crazy cutoff game. Like, you do me dirty, I cut you off immediately. Like, on some old, you text me, you be keep texting me. You keep texting question marks, you won't get it. I'm, I'm going to stop you on Instagram. Social media, Snapchat, MySpace, Facebook, Black Planet, <laughs> Christian Mingle, wherever you need to see me, I'm cutting you off because I don't F with you no more. My, my cutoff game is amazing. I'm the type of person like this, right? I ain't never gonna even tell you what you did wrong. You I'm, would never know why you got cut off. I'm the same way. Let you figure it out. So, give me a story, like an example. It could be the last person you cut off. Yeah, yeah, now the last person I cut off, I would say, he was talking too much to my wife. Mm -hmm. And you know somebody that that like being too friendly, too too friendly. Yeah. They, he he didn't cross me, but you know to that point where it's like he knows a little too much. He's calling a little too much. He's texting a little too much. It almost seems like he's trying to holler. Mm -hmm. Like once you get to that level right there, nah, B. That's it. So now you give us a story. You got one? I remember when I was broke, when I was messed up. It'd be a female to cut me off because somebody else got some more money or somebody else doing this and that. He got a car. I ain't got no car yet. For example, it was just one female I was talking to. She always wanted to go to the movies or go out to eat or go to the mall. She wanted to go buy matching stuff and all this and that. I ain't never had no money. You feel me? I probably had $300. Mm -hmm. And I'm trying to shoot dice with that. I got to do all this and that. This got to last me because right. I ain't got no job or nothing. I take $70. So I know I ain't going to be spending crazy. So when we left, I could tell it was like a bad vibe. You know what I'm saying? Like, oh, this nigga broke. You feel me? The next day we at school, she don't even speak to me. Damn. You feel me? She ain't texting back, answering, and all this and that. I get to see her with the senior dude. You feel me? He played for the football team. He got a little hustle going. You know what I'm saying? He yeah, got some yeah, money. Yeah. You feel me? So I was, they come in matching J's. I'm like, damn, it's over for me. <laughs> and I just cut off after that. Where he at now, though? Shit. I think I seen him at McDonald's somewhere. There you go. Well, Working at that motherfucker. Hey. You ate something today, bro? Nah, I'm starving. What we got, man? You got some food coming through here. You got some food? All right. Yeah. Kill you if you freeze when your jaw was the squeeze, nigga. I got a Uzi in this sound like. Ooh. I got a Draco in this sound like. Sheesh. Knock your shit open. The bullets explosive. Falling, you get stood over. Can't run out of bullets in the shootout. Taking my time, counting as I'm blowing. Yeah, drumsticks. Guitar size ARs. We a little band. Rapper diss me. I'm at every show. This food game looks amazing. I'm all. Yeah, I, I do a drum. You give him the big piece, you give him the breast, and you give me the, the little drum inside. Right, nah, I'm good. I, 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 nah, I'm good. I'm all right. I keep my little. I'm on. I'm on a diet. Now nah, I'm good. Ah, right, there you go. Thank you. Ah, right, thank you. Everybody cool. What that is right there? Yeah, what was this? This is something special on the house. Oh yeah, something special on the house. Enjoy. You got me in this uh, she she foo foo spot, so I don't know what <laughs> I don't know what it is. Usually we put syrup on our waffles, but hey, we'll try it. I'll try it. That's cool. Is it good? Oh, thank you. Thank you. It tastes like Superman ice cream. Summer That's what it tastes like, Superman ice cream? I'm gonna try a piece of that. Let's talk about this new album, man. I heard you, I heard you got some, some some amazing music. Scriptures. That's the title of it. Call it that because it's like everything on there. Stuff to live by. Mm -hmm. You know? You feel any pressure? Not for real. I don't really focus on doing a certain thing when I go in there. My thing be just make some good music. Yeah, cause you got so many street anthems. It's like, you worry about, you know, do I make another street anthem or do you worry about radio? Or do you worry about just doing a complete album? Like, 
What's the mind frame when you go back in there? I'm gonna tell you one thing I learned. If I go make another street anthem, if I go in there on a street anthem vibe, they gonna say it sound the same. If I go in there, I need something bigger for the radio that can cross over type. They gonna say it's trash or he ain't sound like yourself or, you know what I'm saying? Right. So I just go in there and do his natural, whatever happened, happened. I wanted to go get Timberland for this one though. Tim? Mm-hmm. How many records Tim did? Tim did a majority of them. Really? I was working with that legend. His beats make me want to write to him. Yeah. And then you got to think of all the people he worked with, from Pharrell to Missy to Justin Timberlake to... Jay-Z. Hove. Aaliyah. Aaliyah, Nas, you know, that, you know. I respect his opinion so much just because of that. Absolutely. Absolutely. Tim's one, he's definitely, the, he's one of the greatest, man. One of the greatest with it. People like y'all who, a lot of music come through your hands. Mm -hmm. I'm sure you fellas were waiting for this. Yeah, yeah. thank you. Appreciate that. People like y'all who a lot of music comes to your hands. Respect their pain. Y'all hear so much of it. Yeah. Get greedy. Put them to sleep. They gotta identify him by his teeth. We gon' kill you if you freeze when your job was the squeeze, nigga. I got a Uzi in this sound like. Ooh. I got a Draco in this sound like. Sheesh, knock your shit open, the bullets explosive, falling, you get stood over Can't run out of bullets in the shootout, taking my time, counting as I'm blowing Yeah, drumsticks, guitar size ARs, we a little band Rapper diss me, I'm at every show like I'm his biggest fan Hollows in that Sprinter van, gon' leave somebody crippled, man, you see your So one song is one called God's Warrior mm -hmm. Tim did that beat So we was in the studio, we done did like eight songs, one night, type of vibe and it's like at the end of the night, everybody sleep, you ready to go. You know what I'm saying? He's like, hold on, I got one more, let me just play this. We come back tomorrow though, but let me just play this though. He knew what he was doing, cause right. he know once he played the beat, wasn't nobody going to leave. Yeah, right. He cut that beat on, that beat was just so sick. And he like, this is a violent beat, so you gotta come crazy on here. I feel like that's gonna be that one. That's gonna be that one? That's gonna be that one that make you wanna work out. Got some dessert coming now. What kind of truck is that? I'm in the Lambo to yours. Came from nothing, I'm turning Europe. Look at God, Granny be catching no cure. Don't fuck with banana pudding for you, right? Okay. I fuck with banana pudding too. Yes, it is. Enjoy it. Thank you. Enjoy it. No, but man, I definitely appreciate you coming out. And I appreciate what you be doing for the community, like showing people how to buy and sell houses. You Absolutely. know what I'm saying? I ain't never seen nothing like that. That's 100. Yeah, no, thank you, man. I appreciate you, you having me, man. Thank you, man. Thank you for, for having some food for me today, bro. Yeah, for sure. All right, man. Next time, bro. Absolutely. Appreciate y'all for watching Dinner with Grizzly. Remember to comment, like, and subscribe. God, granny be catching no cure. Don't fuck with these niggas, no sir. See my dog. What's the word? Diamonds, that's like you got served. I'm a big Gucci ticket.